Yo, what is going on, everybody? My name is Connor, but you guys call me Superior, and welcome back to episode two of How to Spawn Trap on Every Map. Another map we're going to be covering in this episode is Sovereign. Sovereign is one of the best maps in the game, in my opinion. It's very, um, it's very even. It's an extremely symmetrical map, so you know it's fair, and which means you can spawn trap extremely well on both sides. So let's kick this off with the side when you are spawning ghosts and attacking the Federation. Now a big thing I want to stress in these um, in these videos is don't only look at the map that I put up on the screen, look at the gameplay. The gameplay is living proof or just it shows how to effectively run it uh, if you are the one getting all the kills in the red area on the mini map. But uh, popping up on your screen right now is the mini map of where you should kind of be and where your teammates should not be. Now the yellow line on the screen once again is the do not cross line. Have everyone on your team on the right side of the line for the side and you or whoever it may be getting most of the kills want to be in that red area and the red area is for the most part right by the stairs right um, you know around that area because they will spawn at the little baseball diamond underneath where it says federation you know they'll pretty much spawn there nine times out of ten and if you put yourself in a good situation you'll be able to pick them off with complete ease and you notice that that's exactly what I'll do in the gameplay I'll just keep running uh, running through that little hallway and just picking them off or you know, I'll shoot them through the window by the stairs. You know, there's just so many different ways to run the spawn trap that is extremely easy and almost or nearly every time I'll try and do it, I'll get get a chem strike or at least close to a chem strike. But uh, the gameplay is pretty awesome. It's like a little under a two minute or just about a two minute chem strike. And, uh, you know, I don't think there is a better gameplay to kind of demonstrate how well this works. You can make it getting a double chem strike on this map or possibly even a triple chem strike extremely easy just with this single spawn trap. So now let's jump on to the other side when you're spawning Federation and a attacking the ghost. Now I think this side is even better than the other side. Now you guys just saw how well I was able to manipulate the spawns. Now just watch how well I do it on this side. The gameplay in the background is a 50 gun streak in under 4 minutes. So you guys are obviously aren't going to be able to see the whole thing. But I do have it uploaded on my channel. It's a live commentary. Uh, check that out on my channel. It's a few videos back. But um, you know it, it, it works really well. Once again the mini map popping up on your screen right now. Um, the yellow line. Do not have any of your teammates cross it. Um, don't have any of your teammates in the red zone either that will screw up the spawns have all of your teammates this time to the left of the line just so it doesn't affect the spawn too much because if they're completely pushed up on the right they're all going to be spawning on you or if they all push up on the left they're all going to be spawning to the right you're not going to be able to get any kills at all so the red area and this is where i am for the majority of the gameplay it's pretty much in that one kind of research center i don't really know what to call it it's kind of a weird like zigzag building um you know you want to stay in there and they'll spawn in the corner and there there's a little corner um you know towards towards uh, how do I say this? Like the, it's the corner like closest to where they spawn, closest to where the baseball diamond is. Um, you know, and the, the majority of the time they will spawn in that baseball diamond. You can look through the door easily and just kill them running by. And um, you know, if they don't have a thumbs like most kids in Call of Duty don't, then you know you'll you'll pretty much be able to get an easy chem strike. Now I cannot emphasize this enough. Just watch the gameplay. Um, if what I'm saying doesn't make sense to you guys or you have any questions, it should be able to get answered from the gameplay. Just because I have run these spawns so many times and I've tried out so many different spawn traps these are just the ones that that work best for me and um you know i've done these spawn traps like in this gameplay i wasn't even playing in a full party and i was able to do it perfectly um but you know that just comes with luck and getting the right teammates so i hope you guys did enjoy this episode drop a comment down below with what maps you guys want to see next right now i am like 15 subscribers off of 3,000 so that'd be absolutely insane now at the time you guys are watching this video it's going to be a friday and you know i plan on grinding tonight going for gameplay so just you know, if you guys want to play with me, because I want to play with you guys since it's Friday, and, um, you know, I plan on going for a lot of gameplays, and the best way for me to invite you guys is to tweet me. My Twitter is at so superior. It's the exact same as my YouTube channel, just on Twitter. So I'll drop that link down in the description. You guys can tweet me. If you guys are watching this video right now and you guys want to play, play with me, just send me a tweet. I'd be more than happy to pick you up since I do want as many people to play with. Um, you know, click the like if you guys enjoy. Let's go for 100 likes. Last one got like 150, which is absolutely crazy. Other than that, have a fantastic day, guys. I am out.